Morning, ladies and gentlemen. Here's a new dawn. Here's a new day. Um, last two days I've not been on vlogging due to personal reasons. Not going to it. Um, just shake because not going. To. Um, so yeah, but today, today we're actually doing some stuff. Um, so we, I think we're going for breakfast, and then we're going to uh, see him uh, take some ice cream, and then coming back. Maybe baking a cake as well. So let's see what this day brings. It's raining, and um, pulled out last night. I think it wouldn't rain. But yes, we are off to turn car route in the next few minutes. Then we're going to see him to get some ice cream and to look at the waves. And we've made it to our destination, guys. We are at CM. Weather's not the greatest, but just look at that view. It's gorgeous. After the last two days we have had, this was just absolutely peaceful to be out here. It's just, it's like a mind reset. And, and if you look over there, them houses up there, money. and. Normally in good weather, you can actually see like dolphins coming along here, but because the weather's not great, you can't. I think if I'm correct in saying, that outline over there is Sunderland. I could be completely wrong, but honestly, you have to have a license to go along out there, but you can, anybody can go in that bit there, going out there as well. But it's just absolutely gorgeous. And it's probably not the day to have, you know, ice cream or whatnot, but gorgeous isn't it plus my mom loves i love the seaside she loves anything like this you all right yeah. do you need help yeah. oh so down south where my mom lives there's a place called Lowenstoft. Uh, it's a two hour drive <laughs> <laughs> get that away from me it's a bit seaweed i don't want seaweed on me but Absolute gorgeousness. So we have now got a plan on the agenda. We're going for a walk with some ice cream and then we're going to go along the front. My beautiful lady. Little one's in the pram. So, oh, I've not been here in forever, so. It's the famous place where we're going to get our ice cream. You want ice cream? Yeah. We get some ice cream. And then I believe we're taking a walk up that way. Some ice cream is to die for. Mm. Liking it? Birthday cake oh, Birthday oh, cake is one of my favourite ones. So we literally went inside for some ice cream and it has brined up a little bit, which is always nice to see, always nice to have. Um, so yeah, this is like the harbour. See them harbour? Absolutely lovely. And then you've got like a balcony up there for people to So this is like a proper view of it. Um, I don't know if you can actually go swimming it, but there's... Um, like pebbles there, and then there's the lighthouse right there, and obviously there's people there as well. So yeah, it's absolutely beautiful, and you can tell the sun is trying to come out. I would honestly pay to take one of these out, not completely out to sea, but just for a little ride. Oh, so nice. How much can all this is worth? Because you've got, wow. I mean, you've obviously got a couple of old ones there, but absolutely gorgeous. And obviously, here you see a wild Joe in tourist habitat taking pictures. <laughs> Did you enjoy your ice cream, my love? Mm. Good. She's just very tired. So when we get home, she's going to go for a nap. And I'm going to have a little one. Um... So, yeah. It's been a tough few days, but we get for it, won't we? In my honest opinion, probably one of the stoniest beaches going. I would not like to have a go on them rocks though. But yeah, one of the stoniest beaches going, but when you get further on, it's like sandier. So we're just making our way up here, which is like a very narrow road. And then we're gonna go along that bit up there, which I think there's a few shops that we can have a look at. And then there's a statue, which you can see 
Just there. But I'll show you what it is when we get close to it. I'm not going to lie either. That boat out there, I would love to be on. I don't know if it's a fishing boat or what, but just to be out there, fresh the air, going into your lungs, would be gorgeous. So, I've not actually ever seen dolphins here, but Darcy said to me there is dolphins here. Obviously, it's my mum's first time here, and she's just said, if we see any dolphins, take pictures. But hopefully, if I see dolphins, I'll get them on film. But, it's so quite a steep hill, and for somebody who broke their ankle, how long ago? Four months ago. Four months ago. That's why we're taking it very, very slow. And we've already said, when we get to the top here, if her ankle hurts too much, I'm gonna have to bring the car up here. <sighs> Am I? Yes. Have you already made your mind up on that? I'm already walking Going down. Going up isn't so bad, it's coming down. It's a fresh Oh, moment. steep incline. Decline, is it incline or decline? Decline. Decline. <laughs> Thank you, teacher. Great success. Imagine if you lived in one of them houses. The view from that balcony would be gorgeous. Looking out to sea. Oh, that's where we are. The marina. I found such a dark place. We've just been to the, like, bit down there, but. And then that leads down to the beach, so. And that restaurant is where Darcy used to work. Well, not that exact one, but. Bunker is insane. This is like all your sort of gift shops, like. Your normal like seaside gift shop so it goes from that shop there and i think it was all around down there and i think there's one or two like little restaurants as well so we've just eaten so <laughs> we're not going to go to any restaurants we're just having a nice little walk and then mum's to see the view from like over there so it's a lovely view this is just an absolute gorgeous view like i said before that fish i think that's a fishing boat do you reckon it's a fishing boat that fishing boat, I'd love to be on, just, you know, see what it's like, oh, yeah. but... <laughs> I've never been on a boat, but this view is just absolutely gorgeous. So yeah, mum's first time to see him. What would you give it out of 10? Like... Oh yeah, 10 out of 10 views at sea, it's like... She loves, she loves the seaside, so anything that's got ocean, little, like, ice cream shops and stuff like that, she loves. But yeah, it's all good. That there is a statue called Tommy. I'm gathering it's something to do with the um, war that took place. So just to expect so Darcy. Tommy was only supposed to be a temporary thing, but everybody in see him signed like a petition to keep him here. And obviously it worked. Um, so yeah, Tommy in see him. Lovely statue. Um, I've seen him before, and but obviously mum's not seen him before, but she loves all, she loves all the stuff related to like wars and stuff, so. And then I here, believe, if I'm correct in saying, it's like the CM Cenotaph. Because obviously you've got all the poppies and all the reeds and whatnot. So, but yeah. Oh man, it's absolutely beautiful. That, I'm not sure if that's a house or not, but could you imagine living there? That'd be gorgeous. Yeah, absolutely lovely. So this is a bit of a closer up picture, well, view of Tommy. Absolutely amazing. Wow. I don't actually know if there is... Oh. So guys, if you want to read that, pause it, smash it. But that is an absolutely... You can't even fit it into, even on a wide lens. Absolutely amazing and stunning. Wow. That is just absolutely incredible. Wow, amazing. Thank you. Absolutely massive. But yeah, that slate. I don't actually read it, but I'm gonna well, edit it in this vlog later on. I'll see if you guys can read it or not, but I'm not promising anything because it's an iPhone camera, not a you know, 20 grand camera. So yeah, this is like, I think the CM Cenotaph with all the poppies. Darcy's there, mum's there. We're just gonna chill for five minutes. She honestly loves to know if what that building is. If it's apartments, a house, or what? Because it looks like it's got a garage, but I don't know if it is a garage. Anybody that watches these vlogs know what that is? Please comment down below because I'm eager to know. So, all in all, it's been a really, really nice day. Weather's actually started to brighten up as well. But we're going to be hitting the road in a minute. Um, Got to do a uh, pit stop at Tesco's to get a few things for dinner. And then going home, I believe we're baking a cake. 
then dinner. And then tomorrow mum goes home and yeah, it's been a long week. But <sighs> I did try to do the e vlogging this week, <laughs> but obviously, because of personal reasons I couldn't do it on Tuesday and not yesterday. Um, I will explain, uh, like, maybe a month or two down the line as to why I couldn't, but now, just not the time. Just keeping it a personal reasons, okay? So, yeah, hope everybody kind of good and happy uh, Thursday. So, I'm very tired. <laughs> very, very tired. So, yeah. Um, Saturday's vlog might be a bit of an emotional one because it'll be three years since. Uh, Damon done his final journey, so but you know, life's too short, make the most of it. You see the fishing boat, a little clearer now because the weather's sort of cleared up. So, that's good old British weather, it's gone really muggy and really humid. My hair is like Saturday, I can't wait to get my hair cut. Got an 8 o'clock baby, an appointment in the morning, getting this mop cut. Now, I'm just going to get the car, meeting the girls up there in the car park. So they have to walk around, walk down because it's really, really steep. Steep hill gone. Now just to go to the car, sit down, pick up the girls, and then finally rest of the day. So yeah, there's actually like a marina activity center there. Um, me and Darcy want to take people there at some point when she's a bit older. To um, I think they do swimming lessons and all other sorts of things. So. Yeah, now back in the car. Just look at that gorgeous view out to sea. It's going up and up now so you can see further out to sea. But would you just look at that view? I would not like to try and attempt to climb that wall because I'd probably break many, many bones. We've been home for about half an hour. We've just been chilling. And we're going to put it brightened up towards the end of the day. Good old English weather. But yeah, we are. I think we're going to Sainsbury's to get some bits because we're making a cake. So it's very high, darling. So we're going to Tesco's just to get some more cake items because we forgot to get them um, the other day. And we've just gone to get all the cakes off out and realised we forgot a few things. So we're going to Tesco's to go and get some bits and bobs. So, I'm very tired. This is gonna be the last outing of the day. And then we're gonna go home, make the cake. Then make toad in a hole. Then make toad in a hole. Yeah, yeah And then, last show that evening, I think on the agenda side, was what we're watching is Gavin and Stacey. Maybe. Maybe. We're gonna watch Gavin and Stacey. <coughs> it's either Gavin and Stacey, or a film, or we're gonna be sociable and talk. I don't know. Do both. Yeah, we can, we can, yeah, multitasking. It's fine, it's fine. So me and Darcy have both decided with a toad in the hole, I'm going to attempt the batter mix. So it can either go one way or the other, one way being amazing, the other way being absolutely diabolical. And I think after, are we doing the cake before or after dinner? I think we should do it before So, we're going to do it before dinner, so cooking with Ben and Darcy. <laughs> So, um, you, you ready for it? I mean, we're not going to do it just yet. We're going to give ourselves, like, we'll do it half past four. It's now 4.18. So, I'm just going to chill here for another five, ten minutes. And then we'll bash it out. And then we'll get dinner underway. So, so guys, yeah, it's been a long day. It's been a nice day. Mixture of weather. Sun's now shining. The washing is outside. Yeah, sun's shining. Look out there. It says on the weather it's not supposed to rain um, tonight or tomorrow, so just give it out there. Hope you best. Yeah, another goes home tomorrow, so be a farewell to her. And then um, it's just another day in the life of me, really. But today has been really nice and productive, so i um, you know, been to the seaside and whatnot. So, but yeah, once again, sorry for no vlog, Tuesday or Wednesday. Um, it is due to personal reasons, which I'm not going to discuss that in a minute. Um, maybe later down the line, I will. But at the minute, it's just not quite, not, not good to discuss it. So yeah. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. Um, please do leave a like rating. Please do subscribe, 
and please if you like my vlogs tell me what you like about them that would be lovely to know but yeah um, until then much love and um i'll see you guys tomorrow night tomorrow night another vlog so peace out and um stay healthy i don't know yeah stay healthy